Hey guys, wait, Ricky, am I in the frame? Uh, yeah, your head's in it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're gonna do a video about why I vlog. You sure I'm in the frame? The camera is kind of weird. Um, what a bitches. So I get asked often. Actually, I never got asked, but we decided we're gonna make a video about it of why I vlog and why I put out a video every fucking single day on YouTube. You might be wondering that, and you're like, Finn, I don't really, I don't, why, why are you doing that? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't really watch any of these things that you put out. And I understand that, you know, that makes a lot of sense, and I don't even know, like, why anyone would ever watch that. You know, I'm like, why do I put out these videos? And it's like, you know, it's, it's just to, to, yeah, you know, and... <laughs> <laughs> What a great and, explanation! And, 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 you yeah, know, that's the thing. You know, it's it's like you don't have. No, to no, no. We're it. not doing that. We're not doing. That. <laughs> Why yeah, are we yeah. not doing that? We're not doing that. Okay. One. Why do I vlog? Okay, so I started vlogging on September fourth. Well, I started making YouTube videos when I dropped out of college, and it was really like because I was like, hey, I just dropped out of college, and I don't really know what I want to do. You know, uh, I didn't have a plan of what I should be doing: get a job, start a company you know, become an actor, a musician, you know, model, and like, you know me, like, I could, I could do any of these things pretty well, like, um, and so I just thought, you know, the one thing that I could do is document my journey, I mean, that's why I, you know, started Instagram, started YouTube, but then, if we then fast forward one and a half years, where I've really just been sporadically posting on YouTube, on average, once a week, kind of like talking about what I'm up to, talk about things I think about, doing some random vlogs here and there, I decided to daily vlog really because, for two reasons. One, because I realized I would want my other friends who I know in New York, you know, in like my friend Lucy in, in Northern Ireland, um, I would want them to vlog because I would watch it, not on a daily basis, but I would drop in there every now and then, maybe once a month, and just see what they're up to because I think it's interesting to kind of see the journey and see what they're learning about and thinking about. Um, so that's why I started and I stuck with it really. I realized that daily vlogging for me is actually way easier to sustain. I was, you know, I, was, I had a period where I was making one video every Sunday um, and kind of like recapping the week, kind of like sharing a thought that I had during the week. And I, th that process really didn't really work for me because um, you, you always feel like, well, number one, if you're trying to vlog and you're vlogging the whole week and then you end up on Sunday having like hours and hours of video footage and now you suddenly have to decide what to put in and what not to put in and then you have like a four, five, six, seven, eight hour editing day every Sunday because now you gotta compile all of this like footage into one vlog. And now because I'm doing daily, I know exactly like what goes into which vlog and the process is pretty quick for me. I mean, I obviously have Ricky helping me out with setting up the videos and doing the whole keyword research part. Um, but I know exactly that every day I have to vlog, every day I have to edit the video, every day I have to upload the video and it just removes a lot of um, a lot of decisions for me. I don't have to do this. When I did the day, the weekly thing, you know, I always had, you know, when when do I film it? Could film it now, but I also could film tomorrow. When do I edit it? You know, I have I have an hour right now, but I could also like finish it in three days. So that that was definitely holding me back. And it's also like I want to. The reason why I like the daily vlog too is because like I f I think a lot of decisions that turn out to have a big impact on your life in the moment you make them they don't seem like that for example the day I decided to fly to New York randomly I mean that was obviously a big decision for me at that point but I wasn't thinking about what it could turn into eventually um, and it was just you know hey I'm flying to New York tomorrow and um, I'm gonna stay for a week and it turned into six months or, you know, me deciding to join with Ben to start the thing, which is now Project 33. Or even the vlog where I hit up, you know, Ricky and asked him whether he wants to come to Bali. So, I think, like, all of these small things that kind of start with a small thought of, like, hey, I wonder what would happen if I go to New York. I wonder what would happen if I decide to build Project 33 out to be not a remote company anymore. Like, all of these small things, and I want to document them. I, I mostly do the vlogs for myself to really be able to look back 
um, in a couple of years and like laugh at myself and cringe at myself, which is always fun. Um, and it's also because it's partly, um, it's half ambition, or it's half belief in myself, half delusion, where I'm thinking, you, you know, if I'm going to be the next Mark Zuckerberg, or the next Elon Musk, or the next, I don't know, something something, then this kind of like part of me working towards that, and me like, not being that yet, that you know, that that person that people put on a pedestal. Um, it's just fascinating to see how it all started because I feel like we all kind of like think in terms of like overnight successes and like, oh, we didn't know this person and now suddenly, you know, they're famous and now suddenly they run a big company. But it's like so much work goes into, you know, before that, before anything like anything of that ever sees the day of light. And, um, I like documenting the grind. I like, you know, showing how like every day we're like doing our thing here and working and putting in time and effort and struggling and not knowing what we're gonna do and figuring out shit and uh, making YouTube videos. So that's why I vlog. It was kind of all over the place. Um, I would love to hear your thoughts. Like, do you make? Obviously, if you make videos, drop down below your YouTube channel. Um, I actually really like you know, seeing other people who are kind of like as me very early on in their journey and just like documenting shit, doing vlogs, talking about their experiences because I think it's kind of cool to support each other. Um, and if not, let me know one of one of the people that you're following that you think is, is cool or is doing something um, interesting but they're not, you know, big yet. Um, yeah, and then obviously if you have any questions, also let me know. And that's it. See you in the next video. Make sure to like and subscribe and also hit the bell button and shit. If you want to see more videos and get a notification, it really helps a lot um, for, you know, these videos to show up and recommend it and like people finding this stuff. And obviously, like you guys know, we are still early on in the journey. So any support helps and all the love. See you tomorrow. Peace out. <laughs> I just forgot to zoom in and it went into your chin. <laughs> Hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up Sitting, breathing, doing all the things I hate a lot But why now? Holy shit, I just wanna make